Welcome back to the channel. Tonight we're going to continue our journey through Game of Thrones with episode 3 of season 1. I think the title of this episode is Lord Snow. So, uh, probably going to spend a lot of time up at the wall with with John. So, last episode they they started their journey back to up to back to King's Landing and John made it to the wall and then Joffrey got attacked by Arya's wolf so they ended up killing Sansa's wolf and then Bran woke up at the end all right you ready mm -hmm. I'm ready when is that an elevator huh <laughs> I wonder if that's an elevator. It is. Oh, it is? To get to the top. Oh. They made it to King's Landing. Welcome, Lord Stark. Grand Meister Paisal has called a meeting of the small council. If you'd like to change into something more appropriate, Hmm. Like, what's a more appropriate? <laughs> You're like, no, I'm good. Where's the council? People here. I don't see one person. Thank the gods you're here, Stark. Glad to see you're protecting the throne. A study old thing. How many kings are for poster, I wonder? And what's the line? The king shits and the hand wipes. <laughs> Brian Samar. <laughs> Let's scratch on. I know. People have been swinging at me for years. They always seem to miss. Chosen your opponents wisely. Hmm. They don't like each other, huh? Not really. It's very brave of your brother. Better than father, too. He didn't deserve to die like that. He just stood there and watched. Five hundred men. Mm. Oh, he alone. Yeah, he alone. When I watched the Mad King die, I remembered him laughing as your father burned. Is that what you tell yourself at night? Mm. You're a servant of justice. But you were avenging my father when you shoved your sword in Aerys Targaryen's back. Tell me, if I stabbed the Mad King in the belly instead of the back, would you admire me more? <laughs> Probably. Hmm. Yeah, they don't like each other very much. <sighs> Lord Stark. Lord Varys. I was grievously sorry to hear of your troubles on the King's Road. We are all praying for Prince Joffrey's full recovery. Shame you didn't say a prayer for the butcher's son. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> huh? I've hoped to meet you for some time, Lord Stark. No doubt Lady Catelyn has mentioned me. Catelyn. Catelyn. Is Catelyn? Catelyn. Well, he sound like he said Catelyn. Cat <laughs> Catelyn was supposed to marry yeah. Ned's older brother. Who? Ned's older brother. That's oh. who she was supposed to marry. Oh, really? But then the Mad King burned him alive, so she ended up marrying Ned. But Baelish... It's had a crush on her ever since they were kids. My brother instructs us to stage a tournament in honor of Lord Stark's appointment as Hand of the King. Mm, this tournament is an extravagance we cannot afford. We will, but still, we'd best make our plans. There will be no plans until I speak to Robert. You are the King's Hand, Lord Stark. We serve at your pleasure. Smile pushed him out the window. <laughs> oh, a little bitty bite like that. <laughs> it's ugly. You ugly. You fought up a die. Like You're a warrior, like your father. I'm not like him. I didn't fight off anything at Pitney, and all I did was scream. You <laughs> sure did. You sure did, yeah. like a little girl. Someday, you'll sit on the throne, and the truth will be what you make it. <laughs> we just liars, then. Do something <laughs> nice with the stock. I don't want to. No, you don't want to have nothing to do with her. Because she saw him... Cry like a baby. Yeah. 
Perhaps we should have a, a standing army of men loyal to the crown, trained by experienced soldiers instead of a mob of peasants who've never held pikes in their lives. What you need? A good king knows when to save his strength hmm. and when to destroy his enemies. So you agree, the Starks are enemies. Everyone who isn't us is an enemy. <laughs> now you see her mindset. Huh? Now you see Cersei's mindset. She's. Mm. You're an idiot. You're a liar. And if you told the truth, Mike would be alive. In That's true. Mm -hmm. Not necessarily true, but. <laughs> she looked like she was going to stab her. She was mm. afraid. So you like it? I haven't played with dolls since I was eight. May I be excused? Oh, she's all right. Go on. I don't like her. Her little Sansa. Mm -hmm. I don't like her. War was easier than daughters. <laughs> <laughs> May I come in? Whose sword is that? Mine. Give it to me. This is no toy. <laughs> That's a lady. Shouldn't play with sword. And I don't want to be a lady. <laughs> Yes, you don't. What do you want with this? It's called Needle. A blade with a name. And who are you hoping to skewer with Needle? Your sister? She'd be the first. She'd be the first and then the prince. <laughs> <laughs> Sansa will be married to Joffrey someday. She cannot betray him. She must take his side, even when he's wrong. That's some, that's some bull crap. That's right. How can you marry somebody like that? You're a Stark of Winterfell. You know our words. Winter is coming. Winter is coming means must mean trouble is coming. Or... Uh, but their their seasons are different than ours. They're. I'm well, talking about. I'm talking about their saying their well, yeah. thing. But yeah, but it also means winter is coming. Their winters are like years long. Like decades, mm -hmm. like it's been summer her whole life. No. Stab your sister with it. <laughs> She'd be the first one. Stab with pointy end. Don't listen to it. Crows are all lies. <laughs> <laughs> story about a crow. I hate your story. <laughs> I know a story about a boy who hated stories. I could tell you about Sir Duncan the Tall. Those were always your favorites. My favorites were the scary ones. Oh, my mm. sweet summer child. What do you know about fear? Fear is for the winter, when the snow would fall a hundred feet deep. That is the time for fear, my little lord, when the white walkers move through the woods. Well, they're moving. Mm -hmm. Ago, there came a night that lasted a generation. Kings froze to death in their castles, same as the shepherds in their huts. And mm. women smothered their babies rather than see them starve, and wept, and felt the tears freeze on their cheeks. So is this the sort of story that you like? <laughs> it doesn't look like it. Yes, the white walkers came for the first time. They swept through cities and kingdoms, riding their dead horses, hunting with their packs of pale spiders, big as hounds. <laughs> <laughs> what are you telling him now? <laughs> He said, what are you telling him now? The way he looked, oh, the mm -hmm. look on his face. That's a good story. <laughs> One time she told me the sky is blue because we live inside the eye of a blue-eyed giant named Macumba. <laughs> <laughs> Blimey. I've seen you climb a thousand times. In the wind, in the rain. A thousand times. You never fall. I did, though. Though, isn't it? So that's a little bit of amnesia. What Mr. Lewin says about my legs. To you and I, back here, my lady. It's nine years since I set foot in the capital, and no one knew who I was the last time I came either. 
Welcome to King's Landing, Lady Stark. Would you mind following us? I would. We've done nothing wrong. We've been instructed to escort you into the city. I don't know who's providing your instructions, but... Follow me, Lady Stark. Cat. You little worm! You take me for some back alley Sally. You can drag into a... He runs a whorehouse. How dare you bring me here? No one will come looking for you here. Isn't that what you wanted? How did you know I was coming to King's Landing? A dear friend told me. Lady Stark. Lord Varys. Your poor hands. Knowledge is my trade, my lady. It's the master of spies. He's got little birds everywhere. <laughs> That's what he calls them. Huh? That little man right there. Which one? That's the one that I go with you. I think he a little snitch. Valerian Steel. Do you know whose dagger this is? I must admit I do not. Well, well, this is an historic thing. Something you don't know that I do. There's only one dagger like this in all of the Seven Kingdoms. It's mine. Yours? At least it was. Until the tournament on Prince Joffrey's last name day, I lost this dagger. To whom? Tyrion Lannister. The Imp. What? Lord Snow here grew up in the castle, spitting down on the likes of you. Pip, do you think Ned Stark's bastard bleeds like the rest of us? Well, he in it now. Next! Next! <laughs> Look at Tyrion. Tyrion up there. Yeah. You're pretty good. <clears throat> Lord Snow, it appears you're the least useless person here. Charming man. Mm -hmm. I don't need him to be charming. I need him to turn this bunch of thieves and runaways into men of the night's watch. The Raven came for Ned Stark's son. Good news or bad? Both. Hmm. Lord Stark. Uh, that old guy that Terry was talking to is... Lord Commander Mormont, that is, you know, the guy that, Sir Jorah Mormont, the guy with Daenerys, mm -hmm. that's his dad. Oh, really? Yeah. Good news? Perhaps you'd like to share it with your wife. My wife is in Winterfell. Is she? One of several such establishments I own. Mm. You're the funny man. Ned! <laughs> Thought he was messing around. <laughs> Quick tempers, slow minds. Broke my nose, busted. Are they gonna beat him up? It's an improvement. What you looking at, half man? Hmm, half man. I'm looking at you. You've got an interesting face. Mm. <laughs> and what do you care about our faces? I think they would look marvelous decorating spikes in King's Landing. Perhaps I'll write to my sister, the Queen, about it. Mm. Making friends, are you? They hate mm. me because I'm better than they are. It's a lucky thing none of them are trained by master at arms like your Sir Bronk. I don't imagine any of them have ever held a real sword before they came here. Your brother Bran. He's woken up. The mere suggestion that the Queen's brother tried to kill your boy would be considered treason. But we have proof. We have the blade. Which Lord Tyrion will say was stolen from him. The only man who could say otherwise is not broke, thanks to your boy's wolf. Peter has promised to help us find the truth. He's like a little brother to me, Ned. He would never betray my trust. Who is Peter? Yeah. Oh, really? Peter Baelish. How could you be so stupid? Calm down. He's a child. What has the boy told you? Nothing. He said nothing. He remembers nothing. Then what are you raving about? He tells his father what he saw. We'll say he was lying. We'll say he was dreaming. We'll say whatever we like. And my husband? I'll go to war with him if I have to. <laughs> <laughs> Let me go. The boy won't talk. And if he does, I'll kill him. Him? Ned 
can't stop the kingdom on one of them too. And oh, you are the only people left in this world. And a weird, I mean, that just got a jacked up. I mean, There's, they got a strange relationship. And so we know who our enemies are. I know they did it, Ned. The Lannisters in my bones, I know it. Well, if we think it's right. Oh, yeah. Peter Bettis' nickname is Littlefinger. So. Littlefinger. Yeah. He's from a part of the country called the Fingers. And I guess when he was a boy, he was pretty small, so they called him Littlefinger. Mm -hmm. Gods be good. You nearly killed for Littlefinger yesterday. <laughs> he still loves you. Does he? <laughs> yeah, he sure does. Yeah, he does. Yeah, so it's been a long time. But I still remember every face. Do you remember your first? Mine was some tarly boy at the Battle of Summer Hall. He came running at me, this dumb, high-born lad. I knocked him down with the hammer. God, I was strong then. Right before I brought it down, he shouted, Wait! Wait! They never tell you how they all shit themselves. Why would they? Mm-hmm. <laughs> What are you mad about? Stupid name. Lancel Lannister. Wait a minute, that's not his challenge. No, it's... He's like Cersei and their cousin. Kingslayer! Kingslayer. <laughs> yeah, that's what they call Jim. Surrounded by Lannisters. Every time I close my eyes, I see their blonde hair and their smug satisfied faces mm -hmm. Jamie kind of looks like the prince from Shrek <laughs> <laughs> <Don't he>? yeah <laughs> he does Lannister son of the mighty Tywin forced to mind the door while your king eats and drinks and shits and fucks is he drunk? yeah probably Robert's always drunk what did the Mad King say when you stabbed him in the back? He said the same thing he'd been saying for hours. But I'm the Lord. He said I'm surrounded. So that was so the guy, the little boy that was pouring his. That was. It was a Lannister too. Yeah, but he's like their cousin. Oh. Uh, yeah. Well, yeah, I would want. I would yeah. want. They'll let you know that it's the Lannisters all, all around. Tell them all to stop. You want the entire horde to stop? For how long? Until I command them otherwise. You're learning to talk like a queen. Not a queen. A Khaleesi. <laughs> You give commands to me. Mm -mm. I don't take orders from savages or their sluts. Do you hear yeah. me? No, oh, that's rare. <laughs> please, please don't hurt him. <laughs> Tell him. I don't want my brother harmed. <laughs> She's like, what? <laughs> That's what you get. Dracky dogs! Mom, I like, I ain't doing shit. <laughs> I am your king! Not yet. <laughs> Let him know you ain't nobody, buddy. You ain't nobody with all these people around. Uh -uh -uh. You walk. walk. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> he looking like what? I got yeah. him. No, he, he, he don't realize he you ain't in charge of nothing. Mm. The 
elevator you was asking about. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's very cold. Yeah, it looked colder there than it did in Winterfell. It's pretty high. Mm-hmm. When you saw it for the first time, leaving this morning. You're leaving? I'm the first ranger. The job is out there. I'm ready. I won't let you down. You're not mm. going. You're no ranger, John. But I'm better than every other. Better than no one. Here, a man gets what he earns. We speak when I return. You ain't no lord there, John. You're just another guy. Yeah, earn your, earn your job. And how do a bear's balls taste? A bit chewy. <laughs> <laughs> what about you, my lord? What's the strangest thing you read? Do Dornish girls count? <laughs> <laughs> He's so silly. Nice wash. It's a joke to you, is it? Is that what we are, Lannister? An army of jesters in black. We don't have enough men to be an army, and aside from your in here, none of you are particularly funny. Listen, Benjamin, may I call you Benjamin? Tell me what you like. I'm not sure what I've done to offend you. I have great admiration for the Night's Watch. I have great admiration for you as first ranger. You know, my brother once told me that nothing someone says before the word blood really counts. <laughs> but <laughs> I don't believe that giants and ghouls and white walkers are lurking beyond the wall. I believe that the only difference between us and the wildlings is that when that wall went up, our ancestors happened to live on the right side of it. I think he's starting to like me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what are you doing? When was last time you bleed, Kalithi? So she pregnant? So they how they, they, they touch your boobies? I guess because your boobies is being. Oh, yes. The Khaleesi have baby inside her. Eat for two moons. Her belly starts to swell. I'll have the boys butcher a goat for her supper. <laughs> I need to ride to Kohor. Don't stand so still. It's harder to hit a moving target. Except for you. You move too much. I'll just hold my sword out and let you do the work for me. Hmm. How many winters have you seen, Lord Tyrion? Eight. No. Nine. All of them brief. Now they say the winter of my birth was three years long, Mr. Eamon. This summer has lasted nine. But reports from the Citadel tell us the days grow shorter. Starks are all right eventually. Winter is coming. This one will be long. And dark things will come with it. We've been capturing wildlings. More every month. They're fleeing south. The ones who flee say they've seen the white walkers. Yes, and the fishermen of Lannisport say they see mermaids. One of their own rangers swore he saw them kill his companions. He swore it right up to the moment Ned Stark chopped his head off. The Night's Watch is the only thing standing between the realm and what lies beyond. And it has become an army of undisciplined boys and tired old men. There are less than a thousand of us now. Hmm. We can't man the other castles on the wall. We can't properly patrol the wilderness. With barely enough resources to keep our lads armed and fed. Your sister sits by the side of the king. Tell her we need help. Cersei don't give a shit. Merak. Goofy no say your nasty. Anna. Sekina. Hmm. I guess her charms worked on them, huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
that's what he wanted Pissing to do. off the wall. I'm sorry to see you leave, Lannister. It's either me or this cold, and it doesn't appear to be going anywhere. <laughs> you stop nope. at Winterfell on your way south. I expect I will. Gods know there aren't any feather beds between here and King's Landing. If you see my brother Bran, tell him I miss him. Tell him I'd visit if I could. Of course. You are late, boy. Who are you? Your dancing master, Sirio Forel. <laughs> Tomorrow you will catch it. <laughs> that is not the way, boy. It is not a great sword that is needing two hands to swing it. It's too heavy. It is heavy as it needs to be to make you strong. Just so. One hand is all that is needed. <laughs> now you are standing all wrong. Turn your body side face. Yes. So. You are skinny. That is good. The target is smaller. Now the grip, <laughs> let me see. Yeah. The grip must be delicate. What if I drop it? The steel must be part of your arm. Can you drop part of your arm? No. That is the grip. You are not holding a battle axe. You are holding... A needle. <laughs> Just so. Now we will begin the dance. Is the Brahms <laughs> dance. The water dance. <laughs> All men are made of water. Do you know this? If you pierce them, the water leaks out and they die. Now you will try to strike me. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> Very dead. <laughs> PTSD. Hmm. 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 Like, I don't want her to do this. I like this episode. It was good. It was good. Yeah. Uh, yeah. A little more. I like the fact they brought somebody in the teacher. Yeah. Then it looked like you like, oh shoot, what well, I, I think he was kind of having like some flashbacks of fighting. That's good, but what got me is the story that um, that old lady no, was, telling, was telling Bran. Yeah. And his eyes like, and then when the door opens up. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was good. I like it. I like it. And I think Tyrion has grew on Jon Snow. He's grown Tyrion, Tyrion, whatever. Tyrion. I, Tyrion. He's grown on Jon Snow. Yeah. They seem to get along. Yeah. So yeah, Daenerys is pregnant. And Jorah took off for somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but I really like when he got his, uh, what's her name? Daenerys' brother? Viserys. Yeah, when, when, he he the, goes, when he got the whip around the neck. You, yeah. How dare you stop me? Yeah. I'm. Uh, they like, just showed you you are not king. Yeah. Especially to them. He ain't nothing to them. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and then he told him, kill him. He looked. He looked. Mm. No, I'm good. Would you like to get back on <laughs> your horse, Casey? Yeah. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, Jorah, he's he's not stupid. He's like, no, nah, I'm not dying today for <laughs> you. I liked it. I was no. good. That was good. Jorah's like, no, if we go back, make it back to Westeros, uh, I'll 
help you out, but I ain't fighting a hundred thousand Dothraki here by myself. But yeah, I like this one. This one was good. It picked up from the last one though. Yeah, it starts to get more, more exciting, well, more, more interesting in the next couple episodes. It was. It was. I just didn't know what Robert was. Is he going mad drunk? No, he just reminiscing. He's just drinking, reminiscing, talking about fighting. Robert Robert's a drunk. They get tired of seeing all the Lannisters. I get tired of seeing blonde hair. Yeah. Blue eyed people around me. I'd be like, I need to go. I'm just saying. (laughs) But he 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 just got them there to keep keep them happy so they keep giving the giving them money. Mm. Because as you heard, there's seven million gold coins in debt. To the Lannisters? Well three million to Lannisters. I don't probably probably I don't know who the other four million are. That's crazy. That's yeah. Crazy. But all right. All right, you did it. Okay. I'm I'm keeping with it. I'm keeping with it. Oh yeah. Yeah, like you're through the slow part of the season. It starts getting more Start getting good. Start getting good. Cause there's only ten episodes a season. Oh, okay. So well, this is okay. This is good. I guess I guess I can keep up with. Let me see. Don't be like. Yeah, like there's a lot of characters in there, but you'll after a while you'll remember them all. And but yeah. Uh, all right. Well, thank you guys. Thanks for joining in. We'll see you next time. Leave a comment. Hit that uh, like and subscribe if you want to no no pressure (laughs) see y'all next next time